Operation Minecraft, Cody here. It, I know it's been a couple months actually since my last video, but um, I've used uh, Minecraft Addicts World and I've created a couple of his creations and I uh, made a couple of my own creations. So um, here we go, here's my creation. It's actually not uh, a creation here. Let me turn it on. Um, it's not a creation of mine, it's just I combined a bunch of stuff to create one giant thing. So what we did is we combined uh, two three pin locks, combined with two, uh, I don't know, I don't know the gate names, I just know how to create them, so sorry about that. I think this is called an AND gate, I think. Um, but what we do is we just combine uh, these like so. Oh, wait, and, uh, go ahead and put the put that in like so and we put a torch on the back of a uh, of a switch that is on the on state yeah if you want a torch to be on the on state or the down state you put a torch on the back of it um, and then put it in that state that you want it to be so this let's say this is our code to open the door so we got off on 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 off on so we put a torch on each one of those that are on and then we combine those into this one and then this goes into the one end gate and uh, when both of them are on uh, off state this turns into a, a positive state and it turns uh, this one not oh whoops <laughs> keep on screwing it up right there. turns that one into the off state and then we click on this button, open the door. This turns that into the off state. So then it uh, makes this line positive. And then we got a um, a uh, pulse lengthener here. And combine that to the door. So it's Peter just to extend the distance. So we'll go ahead and create one of our own. So we're going to go seven blocks, so three, four, five, six, seven. We're going to put, oops. Just do as I do. So we're just gonna go ahead and randomly place some torches just for the code. Alright, and then we're gonna go ahead and turn those ones down. Okay, and then we'll go ahead and combine this one. Sorry for the lag. Connect this to an AND gate, and then and connect this to the. Uh, yeah, this might be a problem. Actually, no, it's not. And then we'll go ahead and uh, set this up to a second uh, AND gate. And then we'll go ahead and set this up to the pulse lengthener now. So a pulse lengthener, you put a block there, block there, and then put three repeaters going that way. Two repeaters going that way, and then back three, put another block there, and put two repeaters here, there, and then put redstone there, 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 and then we're going to put a redstone torch there, one right there, and then a redstone dust right there, I should die out. Now I'm going to connect these, you got to have the uh, redstone dust connected to the block, oh my god. 
Uh, I got out of the redstone, redstone dust connected the block because um, of the the uh, power going into the block. It's just how it works. <laughs> um, and then now what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and connect this to a door. are done. So actually it wasn't that fast for me because I know exactly how to build everything. Oh wait a minute. Oh wait, I forgot to set these. You gotta set these on the last ones. Alright, let's try it now. That length, uh, that pulse length in there should keep this door open for a longer period of time so you have time to go from the button to the door. So it's been about, uh, about maybe seven seconds long. So, uh, yeah, that's the, uh, six pin combo lock, uh, combined with the, uh, pulse length there. Hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, please leave a rating and subscribe. It helps a lot. Thank you guys, and I'll see you later. Bye.